All right. Now before we jump into the demo and write some JSON, first let's take a look at the information that we would like to use in our JSON example. So here this sample.txt file is going to represent a patient and it's this is history. The intention of this document is to visualize you how we use this information to form the JSON object. So here the first thing we want to have is the patient demographic information like the patient ID, patient name, patient gender and so on and so forth in the EMR application. And then we want to have a series of details about the patient's disease history which will be a list of different diseases the patient was having in the past. So for each disease we need to know what is the name of the disease and at which date patient consult to physician and what is the name of that physician now here this physician information can be multiple so now we are going to create the json document for this information in this file and as you can see here that the extension of this file is dot json now as we have learned that every json object start with a curly braces just like a c sharp or a java method and within this braces we will add a different fields as key value pair like this and each field is separated by comma so let me add comma over here colon and here our first field is going to be the id of the patient so id and this is the value of this id and then we have a patient name and here we have a value of that key same way we have gender so as you can see here that the name of the key is in double quotes and then there is a colon and then there is a value of that key all right so now we have strings we have numbers and the final type of value that we are going to see to be used in the JSON document field is an array. As we know that as per this document, we have a list of disease history. So it's common that any person could be having a multiple disease. And here we are going to use the array syntax beginning and ending with square braces. So first let me give the key name. And now let me define the square braces. And within this array, let us define the disease history object. So to begin with, let just write out the consult date. And then let us define the disease name. And then let us write the physician name to whom this patient consult. So now as you can see that our JSON document is created as per the given information in this sample.txt file. So now it's time to validate this JSON whether we have created a valid JSON or not. So for that Bytescout have provided one utility in which you can validate the JSON as well as you can also beautify it. So let's open that utility in the browser and let's validate this JSON. So I have already copied the JSON which we have just created. Now let me paste it over here and let me click on this format button. And by clicking on this button, it will validate this JSON as well as also format this JSON.